Well, back here at home, if you search gas stoves on Google, you might notice many articles around the U.S. that say they might get banned from the country. Well, WKRG News 5's Jeremy Jones joins us in the studio. And Jeremy, you spoke with a man whose daughter has asthma. Yeah, Dana, one of the biggest questions about all these searches is that can gas stoves link to childhood asthma? Now, that's one of the biggest questions that I have, and I was able to provide more answers. Kevin Jones says he uses his gas stove every day. I love the convenience of them. I love how quickly they get hot. They have a power burner and they take less time to cool down. A recent study from the International Journal of Environmental Research and Public Health claims childhood asthma is linked to emissions of natural gas. In a recent national interview, a spokesperson from the Consumer Product of Safety Commission's claimed the U.S. could ban gas stoves. I can't say that. It's always safety first with my family. So if my daughter's safety or my son's safety or my wife or myself is at risk, I'd rip this thing out today and get an electric one. And not too long after, articles speculating it could happen started popping up. We took our questions to our local gas provider. But what made the hullabaloo? was that someone in D.C. Grew, saw it and said, this is an issue, perhaps we should consider a ban. And even the, the, the current federal administration walked that bat as, back as well after a lot of the concerns about that type of approach. The study says that asthma in about 13% of children can be linked to gas stoves. But Popielski says the amount of emissions from gas stoves wouldn't cause health issues. That's why you have a vent fan over your stove to vent all of that along with the grease that is you that is that comes off when you cook and any source of indoor air quality problem is almost always related to evaporated grease from your cooking or burning your cooking to begin with it has nothing to do with the fuel that you actually use jones's five-year-old daughter has asthma he says his daughter's condition has actually improved over the years and he thinks the study is just not right. And we actually just went to her doctor last week and she did a breathing test and her lungs are 110%. And that's a miracle because the doctor said normal is 80%. You can find the complete study on our website at WKRG.com. Reporting in studio, Jeremy Jones, WKRG News 5.